Hi everyone, it's Andy. Welcome to my week 41 roundup and weigh-in results. So this week I lost two and a half pounds, which brings my total weight loss to four stone 12 and a half pounds. So I was a little teeny bit disappointed because I was hoping that I might have done enough to get the five stone award and I didn't. So I but next week. Next week it shall be mine. I'll do whatever I have to. If I have to sit for two days straight in a sauna, I'll get a pound and a half off somehow. Uh, <coughs> I've got to get past this mental block because I've got the, this five stone award is, is doing my nut. Uh, I get close and then something, I don't know what it is, but I've got to get past it. And um, I was looking at my book and I realized that I got my four and a half stone award pre-Christmas, but then obviously I went off the rails and put on one stone two over like a five week period. So I spent probably the last four or five weeks playing catch up and re-losing weight that I'd already lost, which was kind of a bit frustrating and in all honesty was pointless. And I, you know, that's why now I say those words to myself. I say to myself, do I really want this? Do I really need this? And is it worth it? Because in all honesty, however good the food was, whatever it was I ate, a cheese board, whatever else I, I, I ate that I shouldn't have, uh, however good that tasted at the time, it was not worth the four or five, six weeks of catch up that I've had to go through to re-lose the weight that I'd already lost. So, you know, in my book now, pushing forward, nothing is worth having to play catch up. It's not worth whatever it is. If it's, you know, cake, ice cream, takeaways, for some people, alcohol, I don't drink, but whatever it is, it's not worth paying the price of five or six weeks catch up to re-lose weight I've already lost. For me personally, that's just not worth it anymore. So moving forward, even if depression and anxiety kicks in and it's raging, I will fight tooth and nail to not let myself be in that position ever again. Uh, and I can do that, You know, it's possible. I, I just keep telling myself those words I, I, I tell you to say to yourself now every day, I can, I will, it's possible. And it's possible for me to, to not let myself be in that situation again because it is really frustrating and, and it's just been a waste of five or six weeks re-losing weight that I'd already lost when I could have now been at six stone. So, but it is what it is. It's done, I can't change it. Unfortunately, you know, we don't have a little machine that we can hop into and strap ourselves in and go back in time, don't we wish. We just have to concentrate on moving forward and moving forward I'm going to do everything I can to not find myself in that situation ever again. The next thing is thank you. Uh, when I started making YouTube videos and, and going on Instagram and starting a Facebook page, I didn't know if anyone was going to be interested. I didn't know if anyone would care, if anyone would actually come and watch my videos. I had no idea. And I've just hit 3,500 followers on uh, Instagram, which is amazing. Uh, coming up for 750 on YouTube, which is just, you know, I'm, I'm so humbled and so thankful that so many people have taken the time to push the subscribe button to come and share some time out of your day with me. And you know, and that means a lot, and it, and it's great. And and I know a lot of you leave some great comments and some great feedback, and and say how you know you enjoy my videos and they help you and and they inspire you and they motivate you. But please, you know, trust me, it's a two-way thing because you guys drive me. You guys inspire and motivate me to to get up in the morning and to keep going. You know, and even on those you know on those dark days when I, I really don't want to do anything. It's you guys because I know that I can get up and I can do something of value that I can do that will affect someone else and and that helps me. It really does. So I just want to from 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 the bottom of my heart say thank you for just taking the time to come and spend with me. It it really really means a lot. So on the subject of Instagram, uh, if you follow me on there, you will know that I said I was going to do a 3,500 follower giveaway, which I'm now at. So I'm going to do a video tomorrow because I'm going to run the competition on here as well. So between here and Instagram, uh, it's a fantastic giveaway, probably the best one I've ever done. It's a huge box of stuff. There's a mug in there. There's coffee. There's uh, hippies, uh, crisps. There's uh, coffee. There's uh, pink and whites. There's uh, digestive thins. There's, there's uh, JD seasoning, spice and tices, all kinds of stuff in there. I'll do a video to let you know exactly what's in there. 
but it's a it's a big giveaway uh, and that's just for me to say thank you because I really do appreciate people just coming and, and spending some time with me so uh, just by way of a thank you just a small token from me to show how much I appreciate you guys uh, I'm going to do this giveaway so we'll get into that in the next video uh, I've also got to do part two of the Could Slimming Well Be Better? And I just want to say thank you for the people that have dropped some really positive comments on there. It's great to see everybody else's point of view uh, and listen to all the stories and and everybody's opinion on, on Slimming World groups. And that's the reason I wanted to do that video, was just to start a conversation. And there's some other people that have made some great videos. Uh, if you haven't checked the video by, uh, by Ria Von Chock, uh, I'll link hers. Go and check them out because it, it's great that people are talking about it. And I know there's some other uh, YouTubers that are, are preparing videos on the subject. So uh, I'll be interested to see those and I'll share those with you as well further down the line. Uh, but yeah, it's just great that the conversation started and, and people are just openly talking about it. And that can only be a good thing. That can only be a positive thing. And that's the reason I did that video. It was from a place of love. It was from a place of wanting Slimming World to be better for everybody. And, and I think just talking about it could, could maybe be the first step and hopefully who knows if it feels its way back to Slimming World even if it doesn't at least we're talking about it and and airing uh, our opinion on Slimming World group so I'll do part two because there were some points that I missed and the video would have gone on for like a fortnight and that wouldn't have been good so I'll do part two in the week uh, shopping day today because it's Sunday so I'm going to get all the things in that I need to do my uh, store cupboard essentials. So uh, lots of people ask me to make a video about the things that I buy and what's in my cupboards and all that kind of uh, Uncle Banana. So we're going to do that. I'll put together a video that shows you some things and I'll recommend some new products that I found through uh, other people. Things that I think you may like. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to do that early part of the week. So that'll be out sometime next week as well. Uh, lots of other videos in the pipeline and planning some other things. Uh, I've got to do some research of some of them, but I'm going to be doing some different style videos, which will be good. Uh, so yeah, let me know about your week. Uh, I'm going to keep this one short. There's not really too much to talk about uh, because I've got more videos coming, which will be you know longer ones and have a theme and stuff. This is just really to let you know what I've done this week and. Uh, I haven't done much really. I've obviously eaten better than I did last week because I've still lost some weight. So that's good. So yeah, uh, drop some comments. It's Sunday now. You've all been waiting, so I don't have to say if you're if you're still going to get weighed in because you've all been waiting by now because it's Sunday night. So drop some comments. Let me know how you've done this week because as you know, I am just as interested in your journey as you are in mine. So let me know if the scales have been kind. If they have, well done. If they've not been so kind, it's one week from 52. Keep telling yourself that it's possible. You can do it. If it's you know, there's a there's a saying that uh, if you fall, fall on your back because as long as you can still see, you can get up. Uh, so just keep pushing. You know, it's it's tough sometimes to get up and dust yourself down and and refocus, but it's it's just one week, and you know, don't let one week turn into two, three, four because it, it's so easy to just let those weeks get away with you. So draw a line under it, forget about it, move on, and just, you know, crack on with it this week. So drop some comments, let me know how you have done. And you can always ask me questions, you know, if you've ever got a question, just please, you know, uh, you, you see that I try to answer everybody if I can, uh, and I, I'm doing my best to, to reply to everybody that takes time to drop me a comment. Uh, so if you've ever got any questions, just please, just ask, just drop, drop some questions below. And, uh, if you, if you feel like it, if you haven't subscribed already and you just happen to be checking out my videos uh, and you like them, please push the subscribe button. Please. Uh, and push the little bell. Patrick taught me that way in time. What a lovely man. Push the bell because the bell tells you when I upload a video and then you won't miss them, which is good. And I've started pushing bells for all kinds of people. I, you know, I'm getting all, And my little boy subscribes me to loads of stuff as well on YouTube. I get loads of like kids' channels. And I don't know, he, he must have been watching Patrick's videos with me because he started pushing these little bells because I get notifications for like crazy kids' videos. And it's like, what's going on? So yeah, push the little bell and, and thumbs up, thumbs down, whatever you feel. You know, just get involved and uh, be part of, of, uh, of what we're doing. So until next week, be nice to each other. Life is always worth living. And until I speak to you again, 
See ya.